Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, are you new here? Sorry, uh, why is my face looking? And now Mary Kay has this latest um, honey glow finisher, which is what's on my face. So, okay, so I've already put it on. Okay. Tiba-tiba jadi macam glowy, sangat kan nampak. Okay, so this is the silver sand, silver sand uh, illuminating drops. I love this. And this is CC cream light to medium. And I'm going to take my illuminating drops. So just... Dab it on. So I'm going to use uh, deep ivory, okay? And I put it under my eye. So I'm going to do it like that. <coughs> the Mary Kay translucent powder under my eye. Uh, and I'm I'm doing this makeup in no particular order. Because it does make the eye look so much brighter and better. So this is uh, Mary Kay Biscotti Biscotti or Hazelnut? I think it's Hazelnut Okay, and this is the color Okay, this is the one And I use a bit of, I think this is called Rustic She is cute okay. okay, and I put it on my crease Okay, so you want to blend it in So that it doesn't look too smudged So the way you hold the brush is also important. Always hold the brush at towards the end, not the cut. Okay. Let's just remove this contouring. Sorry, contouring black making. Kata nanti kan dia jadi streaky. And I use body shot for this because Mary Kay does not have liquid eyeliner, and my eyes are so separate that you have to use liquid liner. Kalau tak dia jadi smudge. So always go from the roots up. Here you go, this is beach too. And uh, what I like to do is using the this brush, like you can be a lot more pedantic lah kalau you nak guna brush yang proper semua. But I realize that this brush is just fine. But you have to use the one yang angle there. Mine looks just it looks so much better than me using the smaller brush for my contouring. So I like it. See? So much better. Like, it's so much better. I just have to lighter skin. You see me? Then I do like to add more here. Some here because. Uh, Kalau tak muka ini flat tau because um, I need a bit of color to my skin. Yeah. It's sangat oily. It's dewy and all that. So powder contouring works best for in this instance. But if you have very oily, uh, sorry, dry skin, then um, there you go. Then um, cream contouring probably works better for you. Lipstick. I like to mix and match. So I'm going to use um, coral here. Mm -hmm. Just blot it a bit. I, okay, I'm going to use always apricot. Uh, you see, this is me not putting any um, powder on my face, okay? Kalau I put on powder, uh, then, um, yes, if I put on powder, then I would need to put the illuminating drops a little bit more. But this is fine already, okay? Dah nampak glowy sangat, kan? But suppose if you put on powder, okay, uh, dia akan jadi flat sikit balik, kan? So what you want to do is you want to take the illuminating drops just a little bit. Letak sini, 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 and a bit here. And um, here, of course, it's very, very important. That's your cheekbones, can, and 
apa here asthma so um yeah well maybe i'll put on a little bit to show you sikit je you really you did it much at all what you want to do is just use your finger je okay your finger is fine so just go like that Yeah, he's playing with my Mary Kay box. What a great product placement ever. <laughs> okay. And if you want to go all out, you can put here also. So I told you when I do makeup, I really do it in a particular order. That's a finished look with the Mary Kay Honey Glow Finishing and also the Illuminating Drops. Okay, thanks. Bye.